Well, Golston, the alleged victim who recently came forward to Sacramento police with sexual abuse allegations against the Del Paso Heights elementary school teacher filed the lawsuit. She claims the district failed to protect her at school when she was 11 years old and in sixth grade. She is 20 years old now. Now her report to Sacramento police opened the investigation into 62 year old Kim Wilson. Officers arrested Wilson last month on 17 felonies involving her and another alleged victim victim who, according to court documents, was seven years old in 2014. The court documents show the alleged abuse happened inside the broadcasting room at the elementary school, which was soundproof, windowproof, and had padded walls. The accusations progressed from frontal hugging and kissing to sexual contact. The lawsuit says the district was negligent in its supervision of Wilson. It says the district failed to properly supervise, discipline, and monitor Wilson for spending Spending time alone with a minor female student behind closed doors, locked doors in his classroom. How many times does this have to happen until somebody says, what's going on in there? Why is, he, why is he in there alone? Where is she? Where is he? I mean, the fact that it happened that many times is just egregious on the school's watch every time. And Sacramento police say a second investigation is underway after a case against Wilson in 2019 was, quote, suspended. That's when another alleged victim came forward to Twin Rivers Unified School Police accusing Wilson of sexual abuse from 2014. Now, Twin Rivers gave the case to Sacramento police, but it never went anywhere. A spokeswoman with Twin Rivers Unified School District confirmed they received the complaint but cannot comment due to the pending litigation. Wilson is expected in court Monday, and he's being held without bail. Reporting live in the newsroom, Michelle Bandur, KCRA 3 News.